going on? My name is Brooke Morrison. Welcome to the channel. Hello. Uh, my buns are not the same size, so please do not, I'll, I'll like stay this way because I feel like I like this bun better than the other one. I'm not quite sure what's happening with my hair today, but um, please stick with me. I love ya. So it is Jackson Wang time. Oh, I forgot. I was, oh God. I, I need to, like, honestly, I need to put just like a static something on that screen behind me because I don't want it to be off, but that's A.T.'s doing Answer on Studio Two, and I watch that all the time. Uh, but I'll figure that out, so ignore that. In case you were wondering, yes, the interview is still scheduled. It's just last week when he actually had it scheduled and we were going to do it. It was like 3 a.m. his time, and it got to be way too late, and he was really busy and had to jump on a call. At least that's what I was told, um, so they had to reschedule. So as far as I'm concerned, still happening hopefully sometime next week. Thank you for all your questions. Uh, if you have not seen that post, go to the community tab and um, you know put in some of your questions you want me to ask him. That's the good thing is you still have time to get your questions in. Cause I definitely do you know a few fan questions regardless. That's like something that I always do. So anyway, Jackson Wang, brand new song. Also, I know I've worn this in one of my videos before. My stuff still is not here from uh, Florida. So I'm still waiting on the rest of my things, which includes the majority of my clothes. So I am re-wearing outfits. I am sorry, I'm just wearing like literally sweatpants Hold on, some just like blue sweat pit. This is like my life right now. So that is <sighs> me being fashionable. But another thing I wanted to ask you guys, what other content you would like to see on the channel? Cause as I'm approaching 20,000 subscribers, I have like 18.8 right now, which is, I, I'm, I just, yes, thank you. Thank you very, I just, yeah, I'm honored, honestly, is like the word I want to use, but um, I definitely want to get into more stuff. Obviously, I'm a radio personality by trade, so um, I don't know, maybe some live shows that, you know, I already do interviews here, so that's, you know, something that we can do more of. I don't know, what other kind of content would you want to see from me, you know, and bringing more of my peoples on here? I definitely already have like a DJ lined up for next week to do a reaction with me. I'm very excited to have her on. And another radio personality who's actually an alternative radio personality, here in uh, LA at K-Rock, who is kind of, you know, has the opinion of K-pop where it's just kind of like, oh God, that's K-pop that I think a lot of people in the industry have. So I'm very excited to see her react to something. Uh, comment below which groups you think you or she should react to, because honestly, I kind of feel like maybe like a Stray Kids or an ATs moment, you know, the more hardcore groups, I think she would really appreciate. So let me know what your opinions are on that as well, because I definitely want to get her on. I'm not going to say who it is yet, but um, hopefully that happens whenever her schedule lets up too. But definitely my DJ friend is coming next week. So very excited to have all these people on the channel as we move forward. Make sure to follow me on Instagram for any updates at I am Brooke Morrison and uh, let's get in to this Jackson Wang brand new video which dropped last night. Let's go. Team Wang. Yes. Captions are on, by the way. You guys always say that. They're on. Leave me loving you. I can read English. Yes. Yes, working Jackson. Oh, he looks so handsome. We keep on touching. That we don't feel. It feels like you're letting your hands off the wheel. Mm. Girl, don't go. What if I just hold on for? Can I just say, I love that Jackson has this kind of like boyfriend feel to him. It's very like laid back. He never goes too over the top with things like on his own, like his Jackson stuff. Cause obviously like with GOT7, it's like they, you know, they're all in like suits and designer stuff or whatever. But whenever I've seen him in videos of his own, especially um, Pretty Please and stuff like that, he would take a white t-shirt. I love that. I love that about Jackson. Oh. 
I love these lyrics. Yes, sing it! Sing it, Jackson. It's kind of got an 80s vibe to it. Oh, heck no. Oh! Oh, why did he do that? He gave him like the meanest look. Was she confused that she came into his restaurant and he was there? Was she confused? I love the raspiness in his voice right now. It's, it has a really good sound. Oh, he's sad. He's sad. Get to work, man. like an immediate add to a playlist of mine, for sure. Man, I want to get married. Oh, how dare she? How dare she? No. I'm hurt. Because why? Why would you leave Jackson? Just what would you do? <sighs> Team Wang, man. All the way. Oh, and I love that he shows, oh, like, the behind the scenes of it in his videos. It's like, this is how he did this. This is what I was thinking. The process that went behind it. It humanizes the entire situation. I love it. Get us to listen to it a second time. Wow. Blocking it out a little bit. It does shock me sometimes that he chooses to speak English. That's so cool though. So catchy now, like Oh, he's so handsome. That is a handsome man. Like not everybody is blessed like that. He he's like he's handsome in every culture, if that makes sense. Because I know the differences between like Korea and America, those beauty standards are very different, but he's handsome in both in both cultures. I feel like that's a hard thing to do. Oh, God, I feel like that's a really hard thing to do. Me loving you. For the music video, I came up uh, with a treatment that follows my... Uh, See? Part three. Place, uh, still staying in the time zone of... 90s. Uh, 90s Hong Kong Chinese movies. Yeah, so cool. Yeah, the way I decided to shoot the video, uh, it's more towards uh, the structure this time. Mm, yeah. Rather than, like, the musical yeah there was no choreo but I, I feel like I didn't miss that at all that was a good I, that's a good video Ugh, the greasy guy giving him a bad look 
it's another love story. Uh, I'm playing a role of a dishwasher in a restaurant. And I fell in love with this girl since the day she came in. Everything about this love story only happened in my mind. Ah! It's my it never happened. Uh, she doesn't know me. And um, lastly, she got married. Yeah, wow. That's, that's, that's cool. I love that. I feel like with like another watch or two, you would have realized that, but I'm so glad that he explained it. Because everybody likes to make like little, you know, kind of snap judgments on videos. Like, I think this is what it means until you hear the artist say exactly what it means afterwards. And you're like, oh, so it's nice that he gives that right away. I love knowing those kind of things. I feel like it gives it so much dimension. Man, Jackson, yes. And I cannot wait to ask him about that if that gets to happen. I'm, 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 I'm always so impressed by him. Leave me loving you. That's what it's called. Yes, I love. And what's funny, a lot of your questions were, will there, will there be a part three to 100 Ways and Pretty Please? And that just answered your question. That is literally the part three. He just said it's still based in the 90s, you know, Chinese movie situation, but you know, he wanted to do it in a little bit more of a movie style than having choreography and dance and things like that. So that was, I mean, obviously answers that question fully. We have, you know, a saga with 100 Ways, Pretty Please, and now Leave Me Loving You. Man, Jackson, just the most handsomest, talentedest man in all the world. One of, one of my favorite moments from him is actually in GOT7 and it's his part in the beginning of the choreography in Poison. And it's kind of like this like weird chicken move. I'll probably insert it, but um, I don't know. It just, it, I feel like he's such, like he makes everything look cool. And I feel like that specific move is like, it just encompasses that entire vibe of his where he's like, yeah, I'm doing like this, this interesting ass move or whatever, but it still looks like the coolest thing you've ever seen in your life. And look at me being epic. And also his outfit was amazing. And that's just one of the, one of the defining moments for me, for Jackson Wang, where I was like, this guy is so cool. I love him so much. But you know, I appreciate you watching. Make sure to comment below and like and subscribe if you want to. I really appreciate it if you do. More stuff, of course, is on the way. And until next time, have an amazing weekend. Bye.